Hey guys, in this video I'm going to teach you how to use Spotify. Alright, so I'm going to start this video by telling you a little bit about Spotify if you don't already know. Well, the slogan of Spotify is all the music all the time as you can see here. And basically what they're meaning by that is you can choose from over 15 million songs whenever you want. Now one pretty cool feature about Spotify is that if you connect it through Facebook, you can actually share music with other friends that use Spotify also. All you have to do is just send them the link to the track or playlist and they can then listen to it instantly on their computer. So on Spotify's website, it says that getting started is simple. It literally took me maybe two or three minutes to start using Spotify. All you have to do is create an account with a username and password, put your credit card in, download Spotify on your Windows or Mac, and then you can start by getting your music. So it's really, really quick download. All right, so how do you get Spotify on your own computer? Well, there's three different ways of getting it. The first way is the free way, but it's invitation only. You need to get an invitation to start using Spotify for the free version. Now, with the free version, you'll be able to play local files, which means transfer the files on your computer already that you have on your computer to Spotify. The other feature on the free version is the ability to share with friends through Facebook. And the last uh, feature is to um, search for over 15 million songs and listen to them on Spotify. Now you will have advertisements in the free version only. So the second way of getting Spotify on your computer is called Unlimited. Now this will cost you $4.99 per month and with this you'll be getting all the features of the free version except for you do not need an invitation and there aren't any advertisements and you have unlimited streaming of music. Alright, so the third way of getting Spotify on a computer is called Premium. Now this will cost you $9.99 being the most expensive of the three. Now this will come with a lot of new features and the biggest feature for me is the ability to have it on your mobile device. This is the only one of the three that will allow you to get Spotify on your iPod, Touch, iPhone, Android, tablets, all these different devices. So that's a big feature. It will allow you to play the local files on your mobile device. It will allow you to play music from Spotify directly on your phone or mobile device um, offline, offline mode which is new on your d desktop and mobile which means that when you're not on the internet it is still back up it is still backing up every uh, all your data from either your mobile to desktop or desktop to mobile whatever songs you have now also you're getting an enhanced sound quality as you can see right here uh, premium members deserve better uh, premium members deserve premium sound quality to be precise you can stream music at a higher bitrate of up to 20 uh, up to 320 kilobytes per second so that's very good you're getting better sound now um, exclusive content you're getting more content than what you would of the other two and the last feature is that you're having the ability to play Spotify through different music systems now these are the three different versions of Spotify now I'm going to show you what Spotify looks like when you already have downloaded the program Alright, so as you can see, I'm on Spotify Premium. I have a subscription that costs $9.99 per month, and I'll just show you what it looks like, the interface. So, um, on this, you'll see what's new, and this will show you the new releases on Spotify, along with the top um, lists, which means the top tracks right now, and the top albums. You can just click these names, and they'll automatically start for you with the start to finish of the song. Unlike iTunes, that gives you about a minute and a half, this gives you the entire song. Now... Uh, there's something called Feed, and that's basically where it's music shared by your friends on Facebook as well as the latest Spotify news. So you'll be getting all the Spotify news feeds, plus if you have connected it through Facebook, you'll be getting all the um, all the music that have sh or music or playlists that have been shared through your friends. Now there's something called Play Q, um, that will allow you to basically tell what songs you want to hear next. It will cue it. Um, another thing is called Inbox, and this is where uh, music that you've been sent. People can send you music. Now, this is the premium. Um, this is the premium feature, the uh, offline and online mode. This will allow you to um, not be on the internet while still being able to get music. Now, this is called devices. This is also a premium version only, a premium uh, feature only. This is allowing you to back up and um, also offline. But this will allow you to take your music everywhere on your iPod or iPhone and Android. Um, let's see on library will allow you this is all the songs already on my iTunes account it automatically backed up on Spotify it automatically went on it local files these are all the songs on iTunes this is basically library this is all of them whatever playlist it's all just dumped into this um, starred that's basically if you just want to like um, 
Bookmark, it's easily bookmarks. Windows um, Media Player, I have nothing on that, so it doesn't go on that. And iTunes, which is basically where I put all my songs that I've got on Spotify. I just put it on the iTunes playlist. I mean, I could I could make a new playlist, but that's where I just put it. So those are the uh, different uh, categories of things you can do on Spotify. Um, also right here, it says three tracks, 11 minutes. Basically just like iTunes right here. Uh, once again, offline and online mode, which is pretty cool. Um it automatically will sync three tracks. So these are three tracks. Right now, literally, it's automatically syncing these three tracks on my iPhone that is right next to me wirelessly. So it's in the cloud, which is very, very cool. Um, I'm pretty sure iTunes doesn't do that yet. It might. I don't know. Um, so what's new? Yeah, basically, this th top three. What's new? You're getting Lady Gaga. This is new releases. Um, top lists. All the top songs. All top, let's see, top 100 songs and albums and your feed. I still need to hook it up to my um, Facebook, and that will be it. All right, guys, that is it for the video. If you haven't already, please subscribe. It really helps me out. If you did enjoy this tutorial showing uh, Spotify, please give it a like and favorite. And I will talk to you guys later. Thanks for watching. Bye.